Hey guys and girls of YouTube, this is Wicked Sick Vape, and today I'm going to be showing you the El Cabron. She is very, very heavy duty, beastly looking, nice drip tips they give you. Um, I really wanted this for a while. They were sold out online, so I had to wait, and finally I got it in yesterday. And I usually don't do reviews this quick, but this thing I had to review it quick because. I am in love with this. Let's take a quick vape and we'll break her down and I'll show you all the parts and pieces. Nice clouds. This thing produces awesome clouds. Alright guys, so here's the El Cabron packaging. Right there, standard black box right there. And then you got your El Cabron RDA with the stainless steel comp drip tip that it comes with and you have the black drip tip right here with a different top cap right here so that's pretty cool and then it also comes with the third tip the standard drip tip that can fit into this top cap here for you guys that don't want to have the excessive mouthpiece which I thought was pretty cool, you know, not too many people give you three different options here, which is really nice. And this does thread on right here. The top caps do thread on, as you can see. And also in the box comes with standard O-rings, all your O-rings. Um, they give you the option to have the silver plated stainless screw uh, post with the screw or a copper post with the screw which I changed it out already um, comes with three uh, post insulators and three allen screws with an allen wrench so pretty nice you know they give you a fair share of little uh, toys to play with here so let's break down this guy so you got your adjustable air hole ring right here it does spin it spins on it and then you have your sleeve right here and the sleeve says El Cabron or Slick so you can see here Slick or El Cabron and then you come to the deck which is really nice they did an outstanding job with this so I installed the copper post like I said um, it has a really deep juice well pretty sure it's seven yep it's a seven millimeter uh, well you know you got plenty of juice you can put in there you can pack as much cotton as you want in there um, it's got the five millimeter post three post design uh, three millimeter post holes which are nice because you should be able to fit any size wire you want into it. Um, got the two O-rings, four heat sinks. Uh, the bottom has a copper pin. It says Comp Vape, who makes this, and the unique serial number. So uh, the build in my eyes is really good. Um, I don't really have any cons. This is uh, really nice. The only con I really have with this so far is the is how you have to actually spin to connect your tips you know you gotta actually screw them in which I'm not a big fan of but it does make it a lot nicer you know it's you don't have to worry you can pull the whole top off for the deck now without pulling your drip tip off and it goes in rather smoothly and this giant hole here for the comp their stainless steel comp drip tip you know, you just put your e-liquid down there, you know. <laughs> if you can't get it in that hole, you have a problem. So, let's uh, rebuild her and we'll take a couple more hits and we'll go over pros and cons. Alright, so she's all wicked up, ready to go. And I'll show you how it looks on the deck. Not the most beautiful build ever, but... And that is... Let's see if we can focus a little better instead of on me, but you get the picture. That's 22 gauge at 7 wraps, and it came out to exactly 2 ohms, point, point 0.2 ohms, sorry, I got in trouble last time for saying 2 ohms, so I always forget the point. 
So, all right, let's juice her up. I think I'm gonna use some Mums Elixir. If you haven't gotten any of this stuff through Mums Vape, awesome, awesome stuff. All right, so let's juice her up. I'll take a, a couple plus word, change out different comp tips, and see what we get. Oh yeah, it's got good flavor too, for having such big air holes, it actually throws some flavor. Alright, this is the big boy, let's try the big boy out, let's see what we can get. See how much cloud, how big of a cloud I can get. Don't make fun of me if it's a pissy little tiny one. Not bad. Kind of ran out of e-liquid there, but... Alright, so, that's that one there. Now, let's try... the other comp drip tip they come with. Line the holes back up. And this is wide open, completely wide open. So, and I have this set up 4.2 volts on my mums. Well, let's see what it does. Pretty good. Nice amount of vapor. It does pretty good. Get a little bit more flavor with the smaller uh, drip tip. She's a chimney, man. Absolute chimney. So, let's try the little guy, the standard drip tip. Okay, let's see. Even with that guy, you know, you can't go wrong with any of them. But you definitely, the big boy is definitely the best, which I'll be switching back. I like it the best. You know, I'm not too fussy with my, my drip tips. So, so the pros about this guy, all stainless steel build. All the pieces are nice and smooth. No burrs, nothing. Um, the options it comes with is definitely a, a pro in my eyes. You know, it comes with the two different center posts, two different screws, um, copper and silver plated stainless. Uh, you got your three drip tip com combinations there. Um, the adjustable airflow on it's pretty easy. Uh, the one con I do not like about this, I do not like screwing in my drip tip. I'd rather be able to pull it on and off, but, you know, it definitely keeps it nice and sturdy, and you can pull the whole sleeve right off with ease, so, um, it's definitely a good buy in my eyes. I think I got this off the RBA Vapor Store for 50 bucks, I think, 59 bucks, so, I don't know what the other competition is selling them for or if anybody else is selling them. Um, but Comp Vape did a great job. And uh, definitely, guys, go get one. Uh, if you want to do competitions, <laughs> this guy can hang with the best of them. Um, they're advertising this guy, bad boy as the best RGA ever built. And I don't know if it's the best ever built, but it's definitely a, one of the better ones for the price range in my eyes. So I'll take a last vape and... Yeah, now the cotton broke in a little bit better. I'm getting way better vapor, you know. This thing's a chimney. It's a beast, and it's wicked sick. Buy one.